Hello all, Project Wargaming here with a video on a project that I've been working on. So I have a cobblestone that I've been able to print off and use for inside town, but I actually wanted to make some just regular old paved uh, road for the 10 millimeter World War II project. So um, kind of been thinking about it and deciding how I wanted to go about making it. And uh, I had a couple different plans. I was going to use uh, just sandpaper and use that to cut it out and, and do it. I didn't really, uh, well, I just didn't go with that idea. So then I thought about uh, taking some of this uh, felt with uh, sticky backing on it and then putting this together with that. Mm, still didn't like it uh, because of how it ended up looking. Um, then I got to thinking... Well, this has a sticky back on it, so I could possibly use some tile grout and just sprinkle it on the back side of this and see how that goes. So that's actually um, what I have done. So this is, I did three different experiments. So I just took the, the backing off of this felt You'll see it's just got a little bit of a stick there. And um, so I went in. This is just one layer of uh, just tile grout that I put into this shaker here with a little um, strainer on the front on the cap. And so I just shook that on top of that. So one layer of this. And then I used uh, scenic glue which if you don't know what scenic glue is, you should know what scenic glue is and look it up online. There's plenty of places. It's basically a mix of Mod Podge water and a little bit of uh, soap, just a little bit of soap. So this obviously not quite there. These were the next two experiments. So what I did was I came in and put some more tile grout on top and then sprayed it again with more uh, scenic glue. I did this twice, and then this I did three times. So this is three layers. I kind of like the look of this, but it's just way too stiff. So it breaks way too easily, um, and I think it will actually over time kind of tear off, although, you know, you could probably tear some of those out and make some really cool looking well, things, if I was going to do this in 28 millimeter, I would probably actually go with three layers of tile grout. Um, it still gives you a little bit of flex, right? Uh, flexibility. You can move it around and, and do that. But uh, a little too much for the 10 millimeter stuff. So this is actually just the two, two layers. And then what I've done is I've come back in and uh, dry brushed over top of it. it gives you picks up really nice textures and then i've also gone in and uh, sprayed it down with a um, uh, some uh, a wash so just a wash that i mixed up kind of a brown black wash sprayed that over top of it and i th i think it gives it a it, it tones down the highlights a bit and it uh, gives some discoloration to different parts of the road. So um, I'm very, very happy with how this looks. I think this is how I'm going to go. I'm going to make up gobs of this now so that I got plenty with curves and T's and all kinds of stuff. So uh, 10 millimeter tank sitting on top of it. Thinks re looks really cool. You're still going to get the cracking in it for sure. It doesn't seem to peel off nearly as much. Uh, you could definitely go in and take some off in places and then spray paint over top of that. And that's going to give you deeper spots, obviously, and it's going to make it look like your uh, pavement is distressed or it's got uh, chuck holes in it. Um, so, uh, yeah, I think that this is really cool. I'm very, very happy with how this looks. Just thought that I would share it with you. I got the felt with the sticky backing off of uh, Amazon. Got a huge like 72 inches by uh, 24 inches maybe. No, probably like 18 inches um, for like 15 bucks or something. Uh, obviously I think the black helps um, 
you get this and it just I, I think it's gonna look really really good on the table it's gonna line up it's got a nice thickness to it too so it's gonna line up and kind of match the uh, cobblestone that I will use in the towns itself I could even use this just for a road running down the middle of the town but just thought I'd share it with you pretty cool stuff um, so that's it we'll talk to you later